level here. So that's awesome. And uh, that's great. So far, so good. So, with question is just uh, how long this fight here is gonna last. I'm, I think I'm not making any hits to him whatsoever. Uh, however, he is able to consistently beat me here. And um, I think that for some reason the game just simply does not want me to successfully kind of beat him. Okay, I think it's time for me to get the hell out of here. And uh, oh wow, look at that. Okay, let's get the hell out of here for now. I need to, I need to get out of the combat. He's uh, going after me. You'll get what for. Okay, because I don't have a weapon, it's going to be really, really difficult to do. It's gonna be really difficult to do anything about this. Surprisingly, there's no way for me to call for help. Okay, um... Player... Strength... Tighter grip... Stamina regime will not slow down combat even on the weapon backswing... Okay, okay... This guy got beaten up a little bit... And... Um, I th let's see if uh, my unarmed um, skill is consistently increasing or not. Okay. Oh wow, finally we've got uh, a hit there. Okay. Oh wow. Okay, it looks like he's gonna successfully block everything from me and he can easily catch me now gladly for me nobody is engaged let's uh let's run uh, close to the blacksmith my father and uh, we'll see if uh, he would join the fight on my side Otherwise, no doubts about it, it would be a little bit broken, right? I'm such a bad fighter, I just simply cannot win this, no doubt about that. In any case, so here we are by the blacksmith, and as you can see, yeah, yeah, my father is going to help me now. And um, they just got engaged. Good. Most people don't want to die, so they may surrender. The victor can be can then decide what to do with them. Let them go. Take their belongings or silence them forever. Okay. It looks like he is running now. And uh, we're gonna go after him. So as you can see, my tactic here to bring the father is turning out to be a success because my father here is going to help me get rid of him and uh, we'll see what's going to happen it looks like he is gonna just kind of uh, run and it's unclear where he would stop. Oh, look at that. It looks like there's no limit. And, and I can't climb through the fence. So, uh, because I don't know how to do it. And that's bad. Oh, wow, look at that. I just needed 
just needed some luck. It looks like that was some kind of a bug that they couldn't do it at first. Now I'm pressing space again, and it kind of has to be. It looks like it has to be done perfectly. In any case, um, now that we successfully beated him there, I could just go back now. Oh, what's that? It looks like we encountered something here. And maybe I finally uh, found my friends. You can't be serious, Dutch. Insulting our king. What insult? I say only the truth. Sigismund has done only what he had to. Had to. He had to abduct the king. He had to lure his cousin Prokop into a trap and imprison him. He had to invade with his army of Tatars and besiege Kutenberg. Why not? What is this Wenceslas for a king? The empire is falling asunder in his hands. The German counts elected Ruprecht of the Palatinate as king because your Wenceslas would not go to their deeds even. German counts. Traitors. Now even the Pope God be with you, Henry. I'm with you, Matthew. What's going on here? Deutsche spouting shit. What? Just listen and you'll hear for yourself. Someone has to bring order and reunite the empire! <laughs> what do I care about the Austrians? And nowadays not even the devil himself can keep up with all the popes. Which is the rightful pope? The one in Rome or the one in Avignon? Do not blaspheme, Alex. No, it's true though. Wenceslas is the king of Bohemia. Bohemian nobles are on his side. To hell with Rosenberg and his cabal. Sir Ratzik is Wenceslas' commander-in-chief. He stayed loyal to the king. And if he heard you talking like this, he would have you whipped like a dog. Your deal will soon have nothing left to rule. Jobs had to sell Luxembourg to help your king. South Bohemia is with Sigismund and... don't forget about Kutenberg, where Germans like you kissed Sigismund's feet to keep their heads. Yes, but... Goodman Deutsch... This is pointless. Let us talk of more pleasant things. My words exactly. Deutsch has gone too far. Wenceslas is our rightful king. Deutsch is an idiot. But what can you do? I might have an idea. Deutsch deserves to be taught a lesson. Doesn't he, Fritz? You too, I love you. You should give him a proper hiding. Are you mad? Do you want to end up in the pillory? Don't listen to Fritz. I've got a better idea. Deutsch was talking such shit, it made me think of that huge pile of manure. You know, the one right next to his freshly whitewashed house. <laughs> you think we should redecorate for him? Count me in. Well, I'd rather touch it, to be honest. But, doing some tears will do. What do you say, Henry? But I was going to get ale for father and a, a few other things. We're finishing Sir Ratzik's sword. Come on. Doing a few handfuls of manure is not going to take all day. And it's our duty to defend the honor of our king. So, how? Are you with us? I'm with us. <laughs> I'm with us. I'm with you. Finally, we met Fritz. So these are my friends, <clears throat> and it looks like we are about to commit a crime. I'll do it, <clears throat> but I'll I need your help in in return. <clears throat> All right, I'll do it, but then you have to give me a hand with something. What do you need? Kuna shows money to father and doesn't want to pay. I tried talking to him, but he wouldn't listen. I need more than words to get coin out of him, and I can't handle it on my own. No problem, we'll back you up. Just as soon as we're done plastering Deutsch's house. I'll be happy to sort out that drunken oaf. Alright, let's go while Deutsch is still sitting safely in the tavern. Good. Doing a go to, to Deutsch's house. Go with your friends to Deutsch's house. Let's go. You land the Western Shim. So, what the hell is that? Right? And... 
beverages, clothing and fashion, fabrics, entertainment and games, events, the Western schism. <coughs> the papal schism of Western schism was a rift in the Catholic Church in the Middle Ages during which there were two papacies existing simultaneously, one in Rome and the other in Avignon, France. It began in 1378, the year after Pope Gregory brought the papal court back to home from Avignon, where it had resided for almost 70 years due to hostilities between the Roman papacy and the Kingdom of France. When Gregory died, the Neapolitan Bartolomeo Prignano was elected Pope with the name Urban VI. He, however, quarreled with the very college of cardinals that had elected him. They therefore declared his election void and elected a new second pontiff, Pope Clement VII, who re-established the papal court in Avignon and was recognized by Scotland, Castile, Aragon, Navarre and Portugal. Siding with Pope Urban VI in Rome, where Italy, Germany, Bohemia, England and Ireland, Flanders, Poland and Hungary, the schism continued even after the death of the original rival popes, with the election of Boniface in Rome and Benedict VIII in Avignon. The popes in Avignon were called antipopes. <coughs> oh wow, and this time European efforts to restore <clears throat> the unit of the Roman Catholic Church were growing. Unfortunately, neither the council nor the popes themselves were able to reconcile as neither side was willing to budge from their demands. In 49, the dispute escalated to the point that the cardinals declared both popes invalid and elected the third, the antipope John. None of the popes submitted to being dethroned. However, the conflict embroiled and the rulers of the various countries involved uh, among others, Sigismund of Luxembourg, who took the side of John, the Council of Constance was convened, convened on November 5th to resolve the issue. On November 5th, 1414, to resolve the issue, the Council secured the resignations of Antipope John and the Roman Pope Gregory, and in 1417 elected a new Pope, Martin V, the base in Rome. This essentially brought an end to the schism although there were subsequently two more antipopes who continued to be supported by a minority, Benedict um, and Clement VIII, who resigned in 1429, leaving Martin V once again the sole pontiff. Let's go now. Uh, there were many things that we learned, however, I don't want to read them when they show because there's going to be a little bit too much uh, of a gap between gameplay and reading, so... Discuss the plan of an attack with friends. So I'm just gonna read at some point in the game. Let's have a chat. So are we doing this or not? Wait. We have to check that the coast is clear. Why? The Deutsch is in the tavern. But maybe you noticed after all these years that he has a wife and a son. And that's a problem? Aye, it is. Henry, you go lure her away somehow. Why me? <laughs> because you're the clever one. Yeah. I could do with a bite to eat. Okay, lure Douch's wife away. Oh, yeah. Let's have a chat. What do you want, lad? Uh, your husband's making trouble. I just went by the tavern and your husband was in there talking nonsense. I thought someone should take him home before he gets himself in trouble. What sort of nonsense? Well, uh, well, he kept saying that Sigismund was right and King Wenceslas is a drunkard, that sort of thing. Some people took exception, so I thought... God almighty, the fool. Next thing he'll start on about the Pope's. He might have mentioned the Popes, too. Thank you for telling me. I just hope I can catch him before he gets into another fight. Okay. Now that she saw me that I'm not wearing any shoes, I'm gonna put shoes on just in case. 
so that I would not leave footprints <laughs> anywhere out there. Okay. She's off. Guys. Let's proceed now. Go and get revenge on Dutch. So it looks like we're gonna steal. Or something like that maybe. No, we're gonna throw shit. What are you waiting for, soldier? Fire the trebuchet! For king and On the country! House. The oh, yeah! My ass. This is all good, clean, Behind him, the Fun. king. <laughs> Nearly as good as having that traitor in the pillory. Nearly. Long live the queen. Be sweet. That's for Sigismund. <laughs> Woohoo! Eat shit, doshes. You bastards! What the fuck do you think you're doing? <laughs> they hey, got back. Can't you see? We're decorating your house for you. It's like your old man was saying in a tavern about that traitor Sigismund. We're just doing what we have to do. Horse hunt! Let's make those smites off your faces! Oh, I'd like to see you try. What are you doing here, Zbizek? Hanging out with this poxy doysha? Maybe you'd like to try out the latest German fashion. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck her! I'll make you pay for that! Go and get revenge on Dutch. Objective started. It looks like we just kind of completed this objective and we'll be moving into a fight now. And uh, let's just uh, try to get uh, a bunch of really, really good hits on them. And uh, let's just get rid of them. As you can see, if for as long as two of us are fighting against one of them, it's fine. Okay. Let's do this. Done. Run from the catch, catch ball or something like that. The guards are not making some notice. Sometimes you have to get to a particular waypoint in a hurry, <clears throat> and if Henry has already been in a certain place, it's not necessarily. To cover the whole journey again on the map and you'll see all the places you can fast travel <coughs> with that <coughs> with that thing there. What the hell? Jeez. <coughs> it looks like these guys right here are criminals. And um, they will stir trouble. Okay, at least we have a wall off. What? Well, what are you honey. doing? In any case, it seems that uh, our I would like to talk with Fritz. Listen, there's this locked chest I need to get into. Really? An honest way not good enough for you anymore? It's just that someone has something that doesn't belong to him, and I want to take it back. <laughs> if you say so. It's not skin off my nose anyway. I've got some lock picks you can have. But if you get caught, you didn't get them from me. Yeah, never heard of you. Thanks, Fritz. Oh, wow. Thanks a lot, Fritz. And um, let's just follow them through then. And uh, that's that. It looks like we'll be hiding here. Not a bad place.
Anybody has anything to say? Oof. He's gone. Fucking Dutch. That was close. <sighs> we almost got caught thanks to that damn Dutch. Okay. I could do with a bite to eat. Let's have a chat with them now that we... We met them.